high bilirubin levels main causes bilirubin is formed by the breakdown of red blood cell in the body the liver helps to excrete it high levels of bilirubin can lead to jaundice this di disorder is easily recognizable due to due to a yellowing of the skin and eyes high bilirubin levels can occur in adults but the disorder is more common in newborn infants this is because it takes some time after birth for an infant to start efficiently metabolizing bilirubin and excreting it in their stool the approx approximate normal range of bilirubin in the blood blood serum is 1.2 mg per deciliter for adults 1 mg per deciliter for children under 18 years of age the skin normally becomes yellow once once levels reach between 2 to 3 mg per deciliter any person who experiences yellowing of the skin or eyes should seek should see their doctor it may be a sign of a serious condition high bilirubin levels a high level of bilirubin in the blood is known as hyper bilirubine bilirubinemia high bilirubin levels can cause jaundice jaundice makes the skin and the whites of the eyes appear yellow due to the brown and yellow bilirubin in the blood there are several reasons for a rise in bilirubin levels outside the newborn period this cause can occur before during or after the production of bilirubin what is bilirubin the breakdown of red blood cells in the body produces bilirubin the bilirubin travels to the liver and is stored in the bile duct the body ultimately expels bilirubin in stools bilirubin is brown and yellow in color and it is this pigment that makes faces brown the red blood cells have a life span of around 120 days and renew continual continually red blood cells contain hemoglobin which helps transport oxygen around the body and it is this that gets broken down into bilirubin and other substances the bilirubin is carried to the liver by albumin a simple protein once in the liver bilirubin becomes conjugated this means it is water soluble and can be excreted unconjugated bilirubin is toxic but conjugated bilirubin is usually not because it can be removed from the body as long as nothing is interfering with its removal before reaching the liver some conditions cause bilirubin levels to be high before it reaches the liver this is the pre hepatic or pre liver phase and it can be caused by hemolytic anemia and the reabsorption of internal pools of blood by the body hemolytic anemia occurs when too many red blood cells are broken down before the end of their natural life cycle in the liver if the liver is not working properly it may be unable to make bilirubin water soluble this may result in too much bilirubin building up in the liver causes include viruses such as hepatitis a alcoholic liver disease some medicine overdoses including acetaminophen autoimmunity or a disorder of the immune system causes it to attack the cells of the body rather than those that cause disease after leaving the liver once the bilirubin has left the liver levels may be high because the bilirubin is unable to leave the body this may be a result of blockage in one 
of the other organs that assist excretion such as gallstones in the gallbladder this is called the post hepatic phase other causes include inflammation or cancer of the gallbladder which produces bile pancreatitis bilirubin test blood test can measure bilirubin levels while there is a urine test for bilirubin it is less accurate and often falsely positive if a routine urine test detects bilirubin a doctor will look at blood serum test to confirm the results and identify any damage to the liver other tests include further blood test to assess liver function and test for hepatitis if indicated a physical exam where a doctor may fill the abdominal area to see if the liver is enlarged or tender imaging test to visualize the liver this might include ultrasound computerized x-ray with a ct scan or high powered images with an mri scan an endoscopy is sometimes carried out to look at the ducts in which the bile travels to the gut a liver biopsy is sometimes needed although this is uncommon in this procedure a small sample of liver tissue is sent to be a, sent to a lab for evaluation what is gilbert's syndrome gilbert's syndrome is a mild form of high bilirubin the levels go up and down because the process of removing it from the body is slowed down the fluctuation fluctuation is really enough to cause the skin to yellow but some people may experience symptoms such as stomach pain or fatigue gilbert's syndrome is often discovered when a blood test is done for some other reason there is a gene linked to gilbert's syndrome that shows family patterns of heredity this gene codes for an enzyme that enables the liver to convert bilirubin to its conjugated form the absence of this gene in gilbert's syndrome means this enzyme does not work <laughs>